Now, Bismillah rahman rahim The first question is, can we say Amin to the prayer of the non-Muslims? Basically, the ulama have two opinions on this matter. Some of the ulama say we cannot say Amin to the dua of the kuffar. The evidence is the ayah of the Quran. وَمَا دُعَاءُ الْكَافِرِينَ إِلَّا فِي ضلال. So for this reason, they say we cannot say Amin to the dua of the kuffar. But what is more correct, Wallahu ta'ala alam, is that when the kuffar, the Jews or the Christians pray for us, we can say Amin. We can say Amin. What is the evidence? Ibn Abdul Barri in his book at Tamuhid mentioned that the meaning of Amin is Allahumma stajiblana du'a'ana. This is what Ibn Abdul Barri mentioned. Allahumma stajiblana du'a'ana. Oh Allah, accept our supplications. So when someone prays and you say Amin, it is not his prayer. Huh? It is not his prayer that you are validating, but you are asking Allah to answer the supplication. Because only Allah answers supplication. And it is also mentioned by Ibn Abi Shayba. Ibn Abi Shayba narrated in his Musannaf on the authority of Isa bin Yunus from al awzai from Hassan bin Atiyah, who said, لا بأس أن يؤمن المسلم على دعاء الراهب There is nothing wrong for a Muslim to say Amin when a monk, a pastor or a reverend prays for him. But the condition is that, number one, the dua must not contradict any of the usul of Islam. What are the usul? For example, if he prays in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, you cannot say Amen. If he says, in Jesus' name I pray, you cannot say Amen. So if the dua is free from any of this, God bless you. Amen. No problem. May God be with you. Kill us all. Amen. Is that clear? So you can say Amen to the dua of non-Muslims, even if the person is a mushrik. You die for army. But if he says, You die for Allah, Sango, Allah, Sango, do your ah, you can't say amin to that one. Because it has contradicted the basics of Islam. And then the ulama also have a consensus opinion that it is haram for the Muslim to approach a non Muslim and ask him to pray for him. It's haram. So you cannot say, Pastor, if Allah dua. Pastor, pray for us. Why? Why would he pray for you? Is that clear? Because of the ayah, وَمَا دُعَاءُ الْكَافِرِينَ إِلَّا فِي دُلَانِ وَاللَّهُ تَعَلَىٰ